Time now for a weather check. Let's get to our meteorologist Leah Pizzetti with our first alert forecast and some cold temps coming our way. Mm -hmm, Joyce, it is going to be extremely cold this upcoming week. If you think today was cold, just wait for what's to come. We are also bringing back the chance for rain and some snow. It's going to start tomorrow, progress through the day. I'll show you that in just a moment, but low level snow is expected by Sunday, especially in the evening hours. Not looking too drastic with our accumulations, though. One to two inches are possible in the low levels. Cold temperatures though into the next week with daytime highs around freezing. So check out these observed lows that we felt early this morning around Puget Sound. We saw sub freezing temperatures already. These were our overnight lows as we progress into the next couple of days. They're going to be right about where our daytime highs will be into early next week. So our daytime highs are going to be where our lows were today. That's because of this extremely cold Arctic air mass that's working its way toward the Pacific Northwest, bringing extremely cold air and even just brushing us. It's going to drop our temperatures drastically. So current temperatures right now across Western Washington, some of us still above freezing Oak Harbor, Everett, Seattle at 35 degrees right now, but many of us have dropped down to below freezing and we're only going to continue to cool in the next couple of hours. Simultaneously, we're going to see cloud coverage building. So by tomorrow morning, when you wake up, expect a gloomy, chilly Saturday morning. Daytime highs will be in the 30s with some areas in the low 40s, and we are bringing back those rain chances. It's looking like around lunchtime is when we could first start to see some light rain. Then as we progress into our evening hours, our chances are going to increase. We're talking mountain snow as well, but it's looking like snow levels won't drop to around Puget Sound until Sunday, especially in the evening hours. So we're starting rain. We're going to transition to a rain snow mix into Sunday morning. By Sunday evening, it's looking like more uh, snow will dominate. However, in the lowlands, like I said, one to two inches possible, except for those convergent zones up to the north. We could see a tiny bit more in those areas. Mountains, maybe four, six inches by the time this is all said and done. Monday is going to be a little bit of a break. We could still see some flurries on Monday, though. Tuesday, the next big push returns. More snow no chances are possible. And like I said, those daytime highs are going to be dropping down Monday and Tuesday highs around freezing. It's going to be cold this upcoming week.